Hey friends, today I'm going to show you how to sum a column or a line in Google Sheets. It's a very simple process. I'm gonna show you how to do that right now. Okay, so for today's tutorial, I've made a very simple spreadsheet. Basically, I've got uh, my sales associates and I've got their sales numbers that they've made in specific months. Now again, I just wanna see the totals as uh, these are adding up and as people are making sales. I wanna know the total sales that John has made, but I also wanna know the total sales that the team has made. So again, what we're looking at is a line total as well as a column total. So let's start with the column total and see how much we actually uh, were able to sell in January. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna click on the cell that I want the sum function to show up in. And what we're gonna do is actually hit the equals button. You click, actually type in sum. And you can see that it's actually giving us a suggested amounts right there based off of what's above it. So again, you can actually at this point just click on that, it'll autofill. And as you can see, once you hit the enter button, we now have the total of what was above. Again, you can check your work simply by highlighting all the cells that you're looking at and then coming and looking down in this bottom corner. And as you can see that, yes, that sum function is now correct. So again, the actual formula here, if you wanted to manually type this in, is sum, the, again, parentheses, the column that you're working in, B, the cell that you wanna start with, which would be two, and then the colon, and then the end number that you want the, the cell to actually, or the cells to actually be a part of. So if you come down here, again, I'm looking, my last number is gonna be B and five. So again, B5. Now, what you can actually do is actually hit the copy. I'm gonna actually, I just hit uh, my copy quick key. You can actually come up here and do copy. And then we're gonna come over here and we wanna paste for February. And that automatically is gonna update for the very specific column that you are in. So that's a nice little feature. Again, if I come over here and hit paste, it's gonna do the exact same thing for column D. So another handy little feature there. So again, let's look at this uh, in the line function and let's actually manually put this in here. So again, I'm gonna hit the equals button. I'm gonna hit sum, I'm gonna do parentheses. We're gonna do B2 and we're gonna do colon. And then I'm gonna do D2 because I want that specific line and not all of these cells. Again, we're looking at B2 through D2. I'm gonna hit enter, and as you can see, that's now totaling up. Okay, let me show you another little handy feature you can use. I'm gonna go down here to the cell below. I'm gonna hit equals, and I'm gonna hit sum, and I'm gonna hit parentheses. Now again, this is opening it up for whatever I would like to put in now. So what I can actually do is I could come over here and let's say I actually wanted to, for some reason, just show all of Jenny's numbers in this specific cell. What I can do is I can highlight this and drag it over and grab these three cells. Then I just need to come back over and close the parentheses and hit enter. And as you can see, this is now adding up, if you actually double click on this, it'll show you this is adding up the line down here. So again, that little drag feature is actually really, really nice. Let's go ahead and delete that. All right, friends, that is a really quick summary of the various ways that you can use the sum function, both for columns and lines, and a couple of helpful little tips and tricks you can use along the way. I hope that's helped. If it has, would you hit that thumbs up button for us? and hit that subscribe button. We got a lot more Google Sheet tutorial videos that are coming up real soon. Thanks for watching.